I'm not a Kmart. You know it's Kmart when. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to another weekly vlog. If you've just clicked this video, I'm Renee. And I'm Jasmine. And it is Easter long weekend. So it's Monday yep. and we're all home. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning. Oh, and also our times are the same now. Oh my God, daylight savings ended yesterday. No more yep. New South Wales, Queensland time talk. It's so literally good. just the one time. And I'm just about to make us breakfast. Yep, Jasmine's gonna make me breakfast while I continue editing the weekly vlog that's going up this week. We're a little bit behind so I've got a lot of work to do today. And um, we didn't do any editing yesterday because um yeah. No we're getting really addicted to the Twilight Saga. We haven't seen it in a really long time. So good. Yeah but not only that we watched Ginny and Georgia binge watched oh. all of that and now we've watched Twilight and then we watched New Moon and now we're gonna watch Eclipse tonight aren't we Jess? Yeah 100%. Raining. We ate pretty much all our chocolate on the lounge watching TV all day. Like I'm, we're, I'm not actually kidding. Just I think we started at about nine o'clock and ended at nine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> went to bed. Like we were on the lounge eating chocolate and watching movies. I did some stretching last night though. Yeah, I had to this morning. Mm. Anyways, we're gonna get on with the day and Jasmine's gonna make me breakfast. Welcome to another weekly vlog. <laughs> this is what we got for Easter by the way. Maybe we'll show them. Yeah. Because we didn't vlog yesterday, when we woke up, it was really cute because Ben and Georgia, I think mostly Georgia, we woke up and there was like these little Easter presents on the table and it had our names on it. Yeah, so we had a really, really nice cute. Easter. Very cute. So I've just made our famous oats. <laughs> famous <laughs> oats. I popped in a pinch of salt, some cinnamon, maple syrup for sweetener, and then I just topped it with some chia seeds, hemp seeds, big scoop of peanut butter, and blueberries. Thank you. We never get tired of it, eh? No. That's what we have like almost every single morning. Okay, the camera's all fogged up. Enjoy. Thank you. I'm excited to watch your clips. Me too. <laughs> sure what to make yet so we're just having a look in the fridge multiple times nothing is changing anyway when we think of something we will show you what we come up with making some Easter chocolate mm. are you? maybe <laughs> free lunch snack all right we came up with something Yeah, it's good. Mm. It's got a mouthful of tempeh. We ended up finding some tempeh in the fridge and we had well, one tomato left. So what we did, we put some coconut oil on a pan and we roast, roasted, we toasted some fried, fried some tempeh and tomato. We don't have a press toaster. That's the one that we call it. Mm -hmm. Press toaster. So we toasted everything beforehand. Toasted some bread. And then we just put, yeah, roasted tomato and tempeh on bread with salt and pepper. And I put tahini on because to me tahini tastes like cheese. Yeah. Vegan cheese. And she just opened this new tahini jar so she had to mix it all through. And then I also added to mine some leftover potato bake, vegan potato bake. Mm. We want to show more simple, easy recipes on our channel mm -hmm. to, to make it easier to be a little more plant-based in your meals. Um, and this is perfect for a rainy, lazy day. So anyways, we're going to finish our lunch and then get back to our day. What is it, 11 o'clock at night? It's 11 o'clock at night and we just uploaded our weekly vlog. And mm. we didn't vlog at all today. 
we're very sorry. Today was a day where we weren't feeling it because we're both on our periods and That's what you're saying. <laughs> I was on the lounge editing all day, nothing was happening. You guys would have been really bored, probably would have clicked off the video. So I was at work yes. all afternoon and then I got home and Renee was still on her laptop editing. Anyways, Tuesday was a write-off. We're gonna vlog tomorrow because Jazz and I both have the day off, so we're gonna vlog together. We're yes. gonna go shopping. We're gonna go shopping. It's payday tomorrow. It's shopping. Oh. <laughs> we should probably head off to bed. Just finish this jar of peanut butter. Still finishing off my Easter chocolate. Really sad. We'll see you in the morning. <laughs> Good afternoon. Um, it's Wednesday afternoon Hello. and we're in the car. Got the camera down here because we don't want no creepy guys knowing where we live. <laughs> we're just driving through our street. So Jazz and I have decided to go to the shops. We're gonna go to Tweed City and we have a few um, items that we've been meaning to buy. And um, I actually thought we were going to Rabina. Oh, we might be going to Rabina. Stay to tuned. Up. Before we go, we're just picking up our brother's fiance Georgia. So she's in town right now having a bevy. Having a body bevy. She's on having a drink morning. with her sister. So, okay, I can probably lift it up now. Yeah. All right. So, we're going to go pick up Georgia and then we're going to go to Rabina, go shopping because we've all got the day off. So, it's a very good day today. And the sun is out. Yep. Hasn't the been out for five out. days. And I'm sure we'll show you what we end up getting. Yeah, we'll do a little haul. I was gonna vlog this morning, but I woke up at 7.30 in the morning. I got a text from my new job. If you watched our last, last weekly vlog, I did an interview and I think I might have the job. Mm -hmm. So I thought I was gonna be working this morning and then um, it ended up not being busy, so I didn't have to work. Anyways, we're starting yeah. the vlog today now. All right, we wanna put Been some... a little bit slack on the whole vlogging thing, so we're gonna try and uh, get some more footage today. Yeah. Um, we're gonna have a nice lunch out as well. Uh, we're illegally parking in the bus zone. There she is. She's coming. Can she see us? No, she's looking. Oh. You might need to ring her. She's walking the opposite way. No. There she is. Hey. You've got the back seat. We're sorry. No, it's okay. Oh, you got an armrest too if you want. Do you want to say, do you want to be in the vlog? This yeah, weekly vlog? Yeah, in my face though. <laughs> Did you have a baby? Nah, nah. Uh, I wasn't sure. That's okay. Alright, uh, we're heading off. So where, where are we going, Georgia? Rabina or? Oh, I don't mind. So we're oh, we have to wear then. a mask in Queensland too. Yeah, we oh, do. Oh, did you guys get a mask? I have a couple. I have one, yeah. Yeah, I have I two at least. Right. If you see us with a mask, we'll be in Queensland. <laughs> Finally leaving the shops and we saw a vegan pizza. So it looks like we're having a vegan pizza for a snack. <laughs> a little a bakery pizza, not a whole pizza. Oh right. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't had one of these in so long because I've never come across a vegan version of a bakery. Yeah, it's really cool. Look at it looks like. We'll show you the car. I want to buy it now. Okay. Right. Okay. I want to flavor on that one. Wait till you get to the middle. Not bad. I've done some damage. I've done some damage. <laughs> it's fading. Is it clear? Yeah. And it's coming. Not <laughs> bad. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. The tomato wow. looks good. Ooh. I don't know how to stop it. I don't know what to do. <laughs> it's currently 4.20 in the afternoon and we're leaving the shops. We've probably spent like five hours in there. I'm excited to sit on my butt because my arm's hurting so much. Where is my dessert? Oh yeah, where is it? It's now dessert time. And we're having a big chocolate ball with peanut... <laughs> peanut. <laughs> <laughs> we have to show them the thing. Like, okay, guys. Oh, the best snack is the peanut butter envy nut butter filled balls. Seventy percent dark chocolate on the outside, and they're vegan. Boom. Whoa. Mm. Uh -huh. It's hot. Uh -huh. The pizza was good. Recommend if you're at Rabina Town Centre. The bakery outside Woolies sell vegan, um, what do you call them? Like bakery pizzas? Vegan. 
Must I bacon? Mm. Two yeah. options. Margarita or Mediterranean. We've all spent a lot. I'm scared to look at my bank. Me or? I think I've spent the most out of all of us. Yeah, I think you have to. <laughs> <laughs> if you just wait for your pay to go in, you don't even know how much you spent, so. I got paid today and it's all gone, probably. We work to live. We don't live to work. Mm. We'll do a haul when we get home and show you all the stuff we got. I'm actually wearing one of the items that I bought. Oh, shit. Okay, car's on because it's hot as hell. Uh -huh. When we first met A simple text Okay, we're back from the shops and it is 5.58, so about 6 o'clock at night, <laughs> and we're here to give you a, a haul of what we bought today. This is a lot. And of course, the first shop that we went to, you probably aren't surprised if you are up to date with our life. We're obsessed with Bliss and Beyond. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I got two items from Bliss and Beyond. I just got the one dress. Okay, cool. Do you want to show first? Yeah. This is your bag, by the way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> okay, so the first thing that drew me to this dress was the material. It feels like, I can't even explain it, feel that. Mm. Wow, that's so know. soft. It's almost like it's got oil on it, but there is none. It's just so soft and smooth. Mm. And blue is like my favorite color. It is darker than what I normally wear, but I love the bell sleeves that it's got. It's a bit longer as well, so I could wear it in winter, which is nice. And also it's flowy as well, so it's not tight. And I'm loving that in dresses at the moment. Right, anyway, so that's the first purchase from Bliss and Beyond. I got two things. I uh, couldn't go past these comfy looking pants. Yeah, you were like, they were waiting for you. Apparently. Yeah, because this was the last one and it was my size, size eight. It's like the most popular size and this was the last one sitting there. So I was like, yep, it was waiting for me. It's a tie dye brownie ready color. And it's got pockets all around it. It's got pockets on the bum, pockets on the sides. It's amazing. And if you could feel this fabric, it You'd makes already, it even better. Yeah. Mm. And then my other item I got was a jumper yeah and it's got a hoodie and a very unique kind of pattern around it's really it. hard to find cardigans that actually have a hoodie yeah a hood wow. to it true yeah very soft as well it's got like little hair sticking up um we <laughs> we <laughs> don't so do funny. fashion hauls so i don't know how to describe any of this um it's beautiful though fluffy it's fluffy it's fluffy yeah i love and it that brown at the bottom no can't. it's too much hey yeah. okay jasmine didn't get anything from this shop that I'm about to say, but I needed some work shoes and we stopped at Skechers. Really nice footwear. Yeah. And the shoes there feel like you're not wearing shoes. They're so light. Perfect mm. for work shoes. Yeah. These are material based, so they're not leather, um, but they are so light. Like it actually feels like nothing in nothing. your hand. It's like fiber. Styrofoam. No, I don't know. <laughs> like yeah. The fiber stuff. And yeah, so I'm going to wear these at my new job and I have my first shift tomorrow. Oh, and as well, while I was at there, I got two sets of socks and I got two for $30. Pretty pricey, but they're actually really high tech socks. These Good ones, material. she sold me when she said that these are stink free. <laughs> when you wear them, you, your feet won't stink. <laughs> Right, well, um, that. and then I do a Kmart haul. We went to Kmart. Of course we did. Because I love Kmart. I needed a new lunchbox because my old lunchbox is material. So it just collects a lot of dirt on there. And it's just not very nice to look at. So it's pretty stained at the moment. So I tried to find a lunchbox that wasn't material and more something I could wipe down. And I found this. It's like it's a cooler bag. But you can wipe this down so easily. You can literally put this underwater. And it's pink. Like what? How cute. Because that's the inside. I love it. It was four dollars. Kmart. <laughs> Renee doesn't like Kmart. It's actually pretty good. What else we got? We got undies. Oh, I don't really want to talk about that. I, I also undies. need to do a review on those pads that I bought. The sustainable pads. Yes. If you saw that video. I'll link that video down below in the description box. But the one thing that I just want to say is that they are quite large and all my undies are small, like G-strings. So I did actually have to go out and get some uh Big granny bennies. <laughs> granny bennies. <laughs> That's the one thing. Other than that, these they're actually amazing. The sustainable pads. I got some I'll of them separate. Too. But I got cotton ones. They're good. They're good for that time of the month. Sorry, boys. Oh, I got a bra. <laughs> I'll have to show them this, not putting this on. <laughs> um, yeah, so I just picked up this really cute... Because I don't really... I'm not into the bras that are like digging in now. There it is. <laughs> it's very nice. If you've got low-rise uh, dresses, perfect bra from Kmart, and it's no, got no wire in it, it's just so literally cotton. Itty bitty titties. <laughs> Did we get anything else from Kmart? 
Oh, oh I got a shirt. shirt. <laughs> we actually went to the shops. Well, I went to the shops specifically for a black shirt because of my shift tomorrow. I don't have a uniform. Mm. And they said to buy to wear a black shirt. So I just got some cheap Kmart shirt. <laughs> it will do for now. I'm not a Kmart. You know it's Kmart when... <laughs> It'll do. Renee's cringing. She doesn't like Kmart. I don't. That's not a stick on it. <laughs> it's organic cotton, though. See? There you go, eh? Yep. Hey, that made us not yellow anymore, that black. Oh. I'll just keep this on my lap <laughs> to fix the lighting. <laughs> oh, and then we went to Cotton On. I actually went to Cotton On because I really needed, like, shorts for around the house, but I didn't want it to be pyjamas because I want to wear it outside as well sometimes. And I like that they're not too short. You know, I don't like shorts up the bum these days. No, me too. They've got a little bit of length to them, which is very nice and comfortable. And they have pockets on the side too. And pockets. Drawstring. How can you not? Hey. Tight around the waist. Big pockets. So beautiful. I'm probably going to be jealous if you don't like that. <laughs> Still yeah. enough. Uh, and then also from Cotton On. Okay, so there was no size. They didn't have my size. And then I was paying for the shorts and then I saw a lady like put them on the counter and I was watching her and then she's she like, oh, actually, <laughs> she doesn't want them. And so I asked the shopkeeper just to double check if she's going to buy them and she wasn't. So, and they are so cute. I know they're pajama pants, but pff, catch me wearing them at the big <laughs> This is baby blue with little flowers on them, which is pretty self explanatory, <laughs> as you can see. Got buttons down the front of them, which really gives pajama vibes. What else? You need to wear a big daggy shirt. <laughs> I wear that, oh, I wear that blue sweater. I really don't think you could wear these out. They're real pajama. Oh, watch me. <laughs> I will. I like them. They're very nice. Does a real pajama People wear lingerie outside. Come on. Yeah, I guess. And they've got a little cute flare at the bottom. And they're the perfect length. As you can see, they go all the way to the ankle. All right, I'm so excited about this one. All right, hang on. Oh, yeah. This, I'm excited because I'm going to put them in my Where'd ears right go? now. There has to be another bag. Oh, oh maybe my basket? I'll just do this real quick. I'm actually slightly worried. I'm gonna put them Okay, so another thing on my list. I wanted to get some gold studs that match my gold necklace. So I did. And I went to the area where it says sensitive, gentle on the ears, surgical steel. I bought one for the top ear piece, obviously. It's a bit smaller, which is nice. Yeah. So Jasmine's worried. She's trying to find it because she thinks she lost her earrings. Okay, so I've got one of these for the top ear. I wanted to get a stud and a loop for the second ear and then I always keep big earrings because I find that kind of balances the whole ear holes out. So I got these. I really liked how it was like a chunky hoop. And then for the stud, I got these ones. But I'm gonna open these up and put them in my ears now. Update, Jazz actually left her La Visa products yeah. at the shops. Um, so but yeah. And I'm not sure if someone's stolen it, but I'm gonna make some phone calls tomorrow because I stopped at a couple of shops. This is what they look like right now. This is the chunky loop and then I've got the stud and then I bought one of these as well. And then I also got very excited when I saw these earrings because I had a pair similar to these, just different colors. And every time I wore them, I got compliments. So if you find these at La Vesa, so beautiful. And they just look so nice in the ear. Yeah. And you'll always get compliments because it's, I did. I should've got like two of these. <laughs> Anyways, that's all I got from La Vesa. And then we also went to Woolies. Not much of a haul, but you know, let's add some food. Yeah. Picked up some of my organic tahini because when you run out, it's a sad day. I got the, just the organic soy milk. They didn't really have the oat milk that we normally buy. And then we also got, obviously you saw these in the car. This is the car snack. Two box of these. And toothpaste. I got this from Priceline actually. And what I like is all these goodies at the back. It's pretty good toothpaste. Yeah. Every time I shop for products, like I always try and find the healthy version of it. The vegan and all of that sort of stuff. I think that's everything that we got. Anyways, our dinner's ready. We're having mashed potato, veggies, and maybe some tempeh. Or maybe just mash and veg, but I don't know yeah. if it's enough because it's like hungry. four of us eating. And mum and Daryl have gone out for dinner because it's their, how many years? I'm pretty sure it was like 14. 14 like year anniversary. So they're out for dinner to celebrate. Anyways, we're gonna go. Feeling deflated after losing your earrings. I got two earrings. One was like the sterling silver stud for the top and then it was like a hoop as well. Good morning. It's currently 10 to seven, so I'm looking very tired. I feel very, very tired because I didn't really get much sleep last night because I have my first shift today at the job that I went for an interview last week and my shift starts at 8.30 so I got up nice and early partly because I've got curly hair and I needed to wet it and I did not want to go to work with wet hair so I needed time to diffuse my hair so I did a bit of diffusing it's still damp so I can't touch it too much until it's completely dry <sighs> but anyways that's 
what's happening this morning. Really need a coffee, so I'm gonna go upstairs and make a coffee, have some breakfast. I'll be at work from 8.30 to 3.30, so I think that's seven hours. I'm not doing the maths right now, too tired. I'm actually burning this candle and it literally smells like a guy. Like a guy's just come out of the shower and you can smell their soap and their aftershave. No, it's one of my favorite candles. I think that's all I need to update you on is my candle that smells like a man and that I have work at 8.30 wearing my Kmart shirt. some deodorant. If you watched our last weekly vlog, you would have seen that I bought myself and Jasmine a natural roll-on perfume. I got this one from our local BP. They've got so many goodies in there and the brand is Ananda Life and it says Byron Bay. Pulse Point Aromatherapy. Women's Support. And this is Numa. ready to go. Okay, I have just come into the bathroom because my brother's playing his PlayStation in the opposite room to mine. Um, but it's eight o'clock in the morning. I'm probably gonna head off pretty soon. But wish me luck in my first shift. Hopefully it goes well. All right, I'm back from my first shift. It was at a cafe, by the way. I've just made myself an iced coffee because I'm feeling very tired. I didn't get much sleep last night. Um, I'm very sensitive to new things in my life. So if anything changes, my body just like stresses out I don't even know okay so you're probably wondering how my first shift went it went good it's definitely a new experience I haven't ever worked in a cafe before at the moment I work as a bartender so I'm very used to pouring beers and not making coffees so I've had coffee barista training but I haven't had like the full experience of being a barista and making multiple coffees I didn't do that today thank god um, but I did make two coffees I failed the first one but it wasn't soy milk I guess it was okay for my first shift also, I was only there for three hours. I thought I was gonna finish at 3.30, but the cafe was quiet, so they sent me home at 11.30. So now I've got like a lot more time in the afternoon. So I'm gonna wash my car and then do some editing. Jasmine's got work today. She finishes at 2.30 in the afternoon. So one, two, so two hours Jazz will be finished. Um, and then I think we're gonna do, um, we're gonna film some clips that you guys have already seen. It was in our haul that we did yesterday. The overlays, all those overlays that you just saw, we're gonna be filming this afternoon. I'm gonna finish off this coffee, enjoy it because it tastes so good right now. And I'm gonna wash my car. <laughs> All right, so remember yesterday when Jasmine lost her earrings, her Lovisa bag? I just called Cotton On Body and they have her earrings behind the counter. So I'm very excited to ring Jazz and let her know. She was like stressed last night too about it. She must be working because she's not picking up her phone. Hopefully I'll pick up the camera and get a reaction because she's gonna be really excited. Hey, good. Hey. I'm in the tea room. Okay, cool. Just head to Cotton On Body, they have your earrings. <laughs> I'm very surprised. I actually knew it was cotton on too.
done finished washing the car next time i am definitely going to pay for someone else to wash my car because i didn't realize like when you open the doors like all in between the doors all dirty like my car literally probably still needs a wash update it's 5 30 at night i've just put on some comfy warm pants because it's starting to get cold jasmine's back from work she's got her earrings i've been doing some editing editing this weekly vlog actually but i've decided to put my laptop down and i'm gonna go upstairs and see what jasmine's up to i feel very lucky because mum's making dinner and we're going to be having vegetables tonight roast veggies kind of feel like watching a movie we actually watched the maze runner last night and i had a nightmare it was scary yeah. Yeah. She's like, I told. told Jazz hasn't been on the vlog today. We're wearing the same color. What the hell? Yep, so I got my earrings back. I actually have one in my ear right now. Uh, okay, you can't see it, but it's actually a little flower with a little diamond in the center. And we don't really have any updates, so we're gonna leave you here. <sighs> it's been a day. Must be nice that you cleaned your car. That's good. I need to wash my car. I'm gonna have a big weekend of just cleaning. Good morning, happy Friday. Um, I'm just about to go to work. I have an afternoon shift and Renee is sitting behind me editing this vlog. I'm gonna be absent again today because I'm giving the camera to Renee and it's 11 o'clock so I'm heading off. I have an hour to get ready, have some lunch. I'm going now. Yeah. Bye. It is Friday afternoon. Um, I've done no vlogging today, partly because I'm editing this weekly vlog and I've realized how much footage we've got. So just gonna keep it short. Fridays are always like quite busy for us. We're always like working, not much fun on Friday. It's currently 10 to four and I start work at five. So I normally leave to go to work an hour before. So then I've got plenty of time to get to work. I'm just about to head off. So Jazz and I will probably, obviously, like we always do, we'll get together on Sunday or maybe tomorrow to end the vlog. Uh, it's us again with our gin. I think it's become a little routine now, ending the vlog with a gin and tonic. On a Sunday afternoon. It's always yeah. Sunday. Sunday's our favorite day. We have the whole day together on Sundays. We make sure that we don't work at least one day in the week. Yeah, because Renee works Friday and Saturday. We got some things done like grocery shopping. So I think we deserve, we're <laughs> sipping the berry ink gin. Berry ink gin. It is, yeah, berry ink gin. In our new cocktail glasses that we bought last yes. week. We're going to end the vlog um, today. <laughs> We're gonna end the vlog now. <laughs> Shit. We're not very good at ending the vlog, but here we go. Thank you so much for watching this week. It truly means so much to us. If you get to this point of the video, we yep. love you. So grateful for supporting yeah. us. Even just you watching our videos is supporting us. And we obviously are... liking the video too. Um, I think you have to have a YouTube account to like the video. Yes. So get onto that. And subscribe. <laughs> we are so grateful for all of you yeah. subscribers out there. Yep, we got 64. <laughs> So yeah. actually truly really great. We actually, 64. yeah, we get really excited every subscriber that we get. Anyways, we're gonna go. Um, we're gonna finish off our lovely Sunday um, while Jazz spits out a lime seed. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye. Just kidding. <laughs> Itty bitty titty machine. Oh. <laughs> Team, the machine. <laughs> What the fuck is wrong with us? I can't do these holes. I'm sweating.